What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. This is Sky Life Projects. Hope you all doing good and staying blessed. Today is actually a Wednesday, the middle of a work week, but I have another video for you guys and we are going to be finishing from the last video installing the um, new carbon fiber steering wheel on my 2021 Honda Civic Type R. This time, Brent has the wheel in the hand. Brent, thank you for being on the channel again, sir. No problem, man. Glad to be here. All right, this is the new frame we're gonna use, but we're using this as a dummy frame, correct? In Brent? case we break it, <laughs> so we have a backup. In case we break the main one, well, now we have a backup. So, we're gonna walk you guys through the steps where we left off on the last video, and we will go from there. But, before we get the video started, please like, please subscribe, hit that notification bell so you'll always be alerted for future uploads like this. Also on that same note, I have a couple different mods added to the GoPro now, a new mic, sound should be coming in a lot clearer. I have a new max lens, which you're seeing now, and then that mod light on top. So I'll be back with you guys. We're just going to get things set up here. Much love and always continue blessings. Stay up, y'all. All right, guys, welcome back. I am actually behind the camera. Brent is holding the new trim piece and he's just making some adjustments. Pull it up right here. Hoping to make some adjustments. Making adjustments with the X-Acto knife. And the reason being, if you guys look right here, like we showed in the last video, these, stubs that are in the way of the actual trim piece which i'm pointing to right there on camera that's what's preventing the trim piece from actually sitting there flush is that correct brent yeah and unfortunately what we found out in the last video if you guys tuned in those aren't just rubber stops oh no, no. there's metal behind them that's freaking aluminum it's aluminum so we were thinking that we were going to actually cut into here with the dremel but we're not doing that because if you guys can totally see this is actually holding the structure of the wheel together at the top is that right brent that's yeah, correct it's reinforcement it's reinforcement right so in case for worst case scenario therefore we do not want to mess with that as that could be potentially a dangerous hazard driving situation if you were to ever get hit if you were to get hit right which we don't want to happen to anyone what brent said so, <laughs> right? Blood, Anyways, blood, blood. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna figure it out. That would suck. Um, and by the way, while Brent is doing this, I did want to introduce to him because he's gonna be a lot more on this channel. He's actually going to be a partner with Sky Life Projects. And we're gonna get this channel going up in a major way once we get the more subscribers. Let me get in the lens here. Um, yeah, you guys, once we get, there we go, more subscribers and everything, then we're gonna do give back to the subscribers, right? We're gonna do giveaways, cash giveaways, you know, things like that, to really just show you guys how much we appreciate you being a member of the squad of Sky Life Projects. So stay tuned for that. It is coming up. Like I said, once we get that target mark of subscribers, Brent, 
He's gonna be my partner in this business. We will have merch, merchandise, right? With Skylife Projects, shirts, shorts, everything that you can purchase. We'll have discounts, everything, right Brent? That's yeah. Like pretty much all. We've been talking about this for quite a while and we're gonna decide to launch it here pretty soon. So be on the lookout for that. And um, yeah, this video might be a little bit longer because I just wanted to show you everything up close and personal with the new lens. And um, you know, hope you guys really enjoy the video. If you do, please subscribe, hit that like button, smash that like button, and um, yeah, we'll go from there. So let me put the camera back here, show what Brent's doing. Come a little closer, down right there. Can you guys see that? How thick these things are. Remember, this is custom stuff. This wheel doesn't really fit this FK properly. Not the Type R at least. So we're trying to make it work because I got a really good deal on this wheel. Brent wants one too. I mean, it's high quality, right Brent? Yes, it's very Super nice. Super high quality, carbon fiber. It's just, I'll show you guys here, it's just immaculate, honestly. 3K carbon fiber, of course, with the red Napa leather right here. Oh, once we get this trim on, we're done. We just put the wheel on, right? Yeah, we just gotta take the old one back off and transfer everything and... So, you guys see, that's the beauty of it with Skylife Projects. There is going to be custom things done, custom modifications, everything like that. So, trust me when I say, sometimes things don't work, but we're here to make it work, right? Yep. That's the part of doing a project. Oh, and the other thing I wanted to say, I know I'm talking a lot, but there's so much to get out, right, Brent? There's, there's a lot yeah. to get out. Um, Brent is actually gonna have an entirely different project than mine. He's going to a completely different build aspect than what I'm doing. Now, we might have some similar parts, but they're like very minor. We're talking the bigger ones like exhaust, um, you know, intercooler, um, radiator, body kit, things like that. Yeah, I'll get them in a second. So, yeah, it's gonna be awesome, you guys. I can't wait for you to enjoy the ride. I'll be back with you in just a moment. I'm gonna get some more tools to set this whole place. Hey guys, welcome back. So, we are just making, as you can see Brent in the background there, the adjustments, the modifications to make that new trim piece actually fit inside the wheel. So we used the drill. Um, we also are filing it down and everything. Kids are in the background again. Like I'm, I'm a dad. You know what I mean. Wife is here too. She's right here. Oh, she just camera shy. <laughs> Anyways, I tried, right? <laughs> She's like, nope. But yeah. We had some food, and now we're just, see, you guys can see it right here. Getting super close. Getting close. Brent, can you show the trim piece up on the camera? Man? Yeah, one second, hold on. We're using a big file, right? A yeah. flat file? Yeah, flat file and, and a little chainsaw, chainsaw one. File. All right. Woo! All right, so. Yeah, it doesn't look too pleasant, but <laughs> we're hoping it's gonna work. Close. Very close, close. very close. As you guys can see it's close. We're getting there. Brent enjoys this kind of stuff, but as for me, so, yeah, um, we're gonna be back. Once we get this file down more, Brent will show it up close, um, or either I'll hold it up close or something like that. But for right now, I don't wanna keep like having the video play when we're, all we're doing is the same thing over and over again, you know? It's not an easy task. This is definitely some real custom shit, to be honest with you. And when it's done, when the final product's done, this is Skylife Projects, that's what we do. We modify stuff 
I personally wouldn't do this, but Brent's comfortable with doing it, so we have another trim piece in case something happens with this one. But yeah, guys. Yeah, I need a fucking haircut for sure. I need in bed. But don't go anywhere. Stay right here. We'll be back. All right, so this is where the video is actually going to end. Um, yeah, we were not successful. Unfortunately, the install was an epic fail. And the reason being, got the wheel right here. As you guys seen in the previous video, we're having an issue with the trim lining up in these sections. On top of that, if you look close, see these grooves right here? See these grooves? This, for some reason, is what is literally preventing the whole entire trim piece from fitting here. Okay? So unfortunately, at this point in time, what I have to do is send this back to the seller that I got off Amazon. Um, the seller's name is K-Miss, and it's by ONC J Japanese Designs, right? That's the company that made the wheel. The seller is by K-Miss. But you guys, honestly, the wheel is ultimate quality, okay? It's very good quality. I don't want to send it back. But because this is a false advertisement, it does not fit the FK8 Type R. Does not fit any year, okay? 2018, 2017, 2019, 20, and 21 does not fit this wheel. However, it does literally fit on the column in the car. You guys saw that in the last video. So... Brent and I went over to my homie Taz's house, who you guys seen also on previous videos, with the white one that says, uh, license plate late to work, student driver on there, right? Him, okay? We went to his house, and we literally wanted to see if the same wheel, which he has as mine, by K-Miss, ONC Japanese design, would actually fit. Guess what? It didn't. It didn't fit at all. Therefore, it does not fit the Type R. We literally tried a 2018, a 2020, and a 2021. This wheel is so beautiful, y'all. The quality is so high. I love everything about it. There is no imperfection anywhere on this wheel. But at the end of the day, if it doesn't fit my car, if it doesn't fit Taz's car, if it doesn't fit Brent's car, our type R's, then what do we do? We gotta send it back. We gotta get our money back. We gotta try something else. So maybe later on down the road, I'll get the, the buddy club, right? But for right now, I'm just gonna put it towards like the APR carbon fiber splitter. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Then I'm gonna get the Honda coming up. Then I might go with the Ferrable Stage 2 tune or with FK8 Clinic. I might do that. My front pipe is literally almost here. I would say about another four weeks or so. Yo, it's taken like six to eight weeks to get here. Okay, still gotta put my motor mount on. I'm waiting for the front pipe to obviously knock those both out at once. So there'll be another video. We got another video coming up this weekend installing, you know what, save it. I'm gonna actually surprise you guys with that video. So stay tuned for that. That's gonna be dope. Um, but for right now, Unfortunately, you guys, it's another fail, and you know what? I don't want it to be, but tch, there's nothing I can do about it, right? I, we literally tried to modify this to, to make it work in these trim pieces right here, and it is a no-go. Epic fail on K-Miss. Do not buy from them for the Type R. Their parts clearly do not fit. It is a false advertisement. I don't know if it fits the FN2 Type R, the European Type R, or what the deal is, you know. But I'm telling you right now, the trim piece for 18, 19, 20, 21, 17 probably even, they just don't fit, okay? So we're gonna try another option, but for right now, yeah, that's all I wanted to do on this video. 
it's the end of it. If you guys enjoyed it, please like, please subscribe, hit that notification bell so you always be alerted for future uploads like this. Much love and blessings to everybody. You guys stay up, stay wild with it, live life to your fullest. Don't let anybody tell you what you can't do because if you put your mind to it, you can achieve anything. This is Skylight Project, y'all. Much love. We out.